This image of Dermot Brereton is out. That's why the lady is a Meet the new Dermy. How big could he get? In Australia, the biggest. You've probably seen the stars of this story. Their faces and more are appearing all over the place. They endorse everything from aftershave to sand shoes. They're pin-up boys on calendars. They draw record crowds in suburban shopping centres. And one of them is about to make his entrance in a television soapy. Dermot Brereton and Andrew Ettinghausen are the kind of guys marketing men dream about. Heroes on the football field who can be packaged and sold to a much wider audience. Leader of the Southern Pack, glamour boy Dirt Brereton. Watching it, the uh, selectors and the powers that be at Hawthorne would be very pleased with this. Brereton from only 20 metres out, and he kicks another goal for Hawthorne. There's more to Dermot Brereton than people realise. He looks good, he's very marketable, he has the earring that makes, makes him a little different. So why Promoting Dermot Brereton, Frank Williams of IMG. He knows precisely how he wants to sell his client. Like a John Farnham. I mean, John Farnham appeals to eight-year-olds and appeals to 80-year-olds. Why? Because he has this lovely image. I want a similar thing for Dermot in the world of football. What do you think of him as a bloke? What sort of bloke do you reckon he is? Good. Yeah? Excellent. This nine-year-old, Chris Mills, is already sold on Dermy. Oh, he gave me his autograph on my jumper and... Um, is that this jumper you're wearing? Yes. Can I see it? But it doesn't have it on anymore because it got washed off. Oh, that was bad luck. <laughs> this is the young Dermot, the raw material Frank Williams had to work with. This raw, long-haired, completely over-the-top uh, footballer uh, who had a tremendous charm, but at the same time you think, God, damn it, what are you going to do next? What about his clothes? He had great taste of one or two items. He had great socks. <laughs> if you wear that, make sure it's a very dark night and you're out and there's no lights about. Yeah, well, that's just a, and, and I, I reckon it's just for a, a change for the rest of my wardrobe. While you know, clothes don't, don't make the man, a, they uh, do make the image. I, you do whatever you like, but that's, that's not what you're about. Did they look at you and say, oh, got to change this? No, not really. No. Well, if they did, I, uh, I missed the point. <laughs> she gets too hungry for dinner at eight. You have to admit, Dermot is versatile. And never comes late. He sings. She'd never bother. Yeah, all right, well, we've got these cheese zingos. Well, not cheese zingos. There they That's are. That's them. That's very nice. Where are we? There he we cooks. Right. Here we go. I know Look. what I'm doing here. Not the whole cup. Yeah, no, just one, one cup. So you're to there is 250 is one cup. He's written a book. And how about nine girls in this year's grand final? <laughs> Claire, did you get that? I got it. Hi, Dermot. He's even acted in a soapy. How are you? Good, thanks. I brought you a few videos. Excellent. Thanks, Dermot. Mum, it's him. Sorry. I couldn't decide what to wear. You look fantastic. He's the love interest. Thank you. Of course. If they say, this is going to be very good for you to do, I still get to say yes or no. Have you said no? At the moment, no, I haven't said no. What I have said is, uh, on a couple of occasions, I don't really want to do this. Was one of these selling bananas? <laughs> yeah. Bananas! Bananas! Bananas are good enough for me. Frank Williams said it's a great product. You can have some fun with it to show a bit of personality. So I said, all right, I'll, if it uh, doesn't work out for the best, Frank, I'll be on your doorstep. It was a fun ad, and I wanted people to see that, hey, he's a fun guy too. He's not out there bashing people. He's out there eating bananas, for God's sake, and telling your kids to eat them. And it worked. Bananas are good enough for me. Can't control it. Darcy the first to recover, and Burton's in the action. 
possession. And it was a crude effort there by Burton. The image I don't want for him is this thug on the uh, football field who uses his fist and his brawn. And, I mean, I want him to be known as an all-round player, good athlete. And above all, I want people to look at him and say, hey, there's someone we can admire. <laughs> He's the youngest boy in a staunchly Irish family. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. He's also, unbeknownst to his manager, an active supporter of Sinn Féin, the political arm of the IRA. Yeah, I feel deeply about it. Tell me what you feel deeply about. Uh, I could really get myself in hot water, couldn't I? Um, Just tell, be honest. Be honest, eh? I'm, I support, I put my money across for people who need the relief fund, who need that money to survive, the Irish people, who need that money. I don't send my money to support violence. Surely, Dermot, you know if you're sending money to Sinn Féin, it's ending up with the IRA as well. You know not that. Really. No. Well, I, I don't, I'm not of that belief. Did you think, oh God, I wish you hadn't talked about that? Of course I did. Because there will be the people who think, oh, God, he's sending money off to, for this terrible cause. And it's not the only surprise Frank Williams has had lately. He was one of the last to hear about Dermot's current girlfriend, Brooke. You think I'd rather have seen the girl in a nice Dior gown uh, with some beautiful diamonds and earrings and looking sensational than in a skimpy outfit. But, I mean... That wasn't the case. Dermot Brereton's management takes 25%. He's not quite so generous about it. I don't resent it, but I'd like to pay a lot less. Yeah. Then again, with Dermot Brereton, there's a lot more to manage. Oh, you hear it hit that tree? Beautiful. You're in trouble. The strategy is to refine Dermot Brereton, to tone down the larrikinism and create oh, shot, a classier image. Hence, golf. Good shot, hey, Frank. You're a kid, mate, yeah? It says, Dermot's arrived, <laughs> Dermot's here, Dermot plays golf, Dermot's in the upper echelon of, of what sponsors want. It's a oh, good image boy, sport, it's a great sport. And he loves it. He can't play very well, but don't tell him that. They think of everything, including a night at the opera. Management provided the seats, Dermot the date. His girlfriend, Brooke, last seen wearing considerably less. I don't think it'd do your image too good if you turned up with a nice, cute little boy on your arm. What would be the common threads in the girlfriends you've had? Oh, oh I'm going to get my bum kicked if I just say these. Um, they're all good looking. <laughs> Dermot Brereton, as you'll have gathered, seeks the spotlight. How big could he get? In Australia, the biggest. 